हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू माय चैनल ए चैनल फॉर लर्निंग सिंपल कोडिंग इफ यू फाइंड दिस वीडियो टू बी हेल्पफुल प्लीज लाइक शेयर एंड सब्सक्राइब माय चैनल इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न हाउ वी कैन पास ए फंक्शन और इवेंट हाउ वी कैन पास ए इवेंट हैंडलर एज ए प्रॉपर्टी टू द अदर कंपोनेंट्स इन रिएक्ट विद टाइप स्क्रिप्ट so for that i am creating a one component and i say the name of this component is basis dot tsx and here we create this function and we give the name here masses and uh, i just remove this no need of this this is the interface by default we have for the property data types we will see it later also here i just created dev here and in this dev i have a button in this button i say show masses and before this i can also print h2 and i say event props in react with type script just for this save it and here in a button i will handle or execute a function that will come from app so here i create dev tag in this dev tag i call this masses like this and i save this right now so from this masses i will pass a function or event to this masses and we will see how we can handle it so here for your example i create one more button here and i say that show masses in app from app that i am executing this from the app means from this so i want to show you that what is the difference between the executing event handler from a same component from the app or if i pass this to this component then what are the changes and differences so here for on click event we pass a function say masses this function i just create here i say masses like this and here just i use console dot log and here i say welcome to react with type script okay and i save this so you see that we have here a simple one interface and we are passing here this event handler just we pass in react normal react application with javascript no changes there and here i save this first of all and uh, i just uh, uh, leave it and i try to show you the event handling right now that in its same component when i have a on click event and i have this event handler a function then if i run it so you will see that in inspection window i just click on this show masses from app and i will have a text here in console that welcome to react with the type script this is coming from here and you see that there is no special coding is just similar to the javascript coding as we did react with javascript now the some changes are there if i pass here same but here is not on click i say the masses event i say on masses because here i am not firing it here i am passing it i am passing as a property so property name is remember that the property name is on masses and i am passing here and i save this and after saving this you see that we have a error error is that this is not assigned to type this and we, that means we do not have the description of this here that what kind of property we are passing to the masses component 
but normally if we are using javascript then this type of message doesn't come because automatically handle what property we are passing but here is not like that here we have to specify the event also that what we are passing here so go to there and here i create props and here i declare message props that interface which we are using i save this and remember that after that after that we also have a error that the property which you are passing that is not mentioned here in interface that is not found what kind of information you are passing from this on message property so i have to mention this here i have to specify that i am passing a message function like this and this function is of event handler type that is the arrow function that means we are passing a function here remember that we are passing this here and i am setting this name to message again it generating error why because this property name is not a message the name is own message so here i have to specify the same property that i am passing from there then i save it you see now error is gone that means the own message property which you are passing from the app component to the message component this data type is a function this arrow function that doesn't return any value that's why we are passing this a function that return a void and now if i try to run and i say show message from message component okay i save this and if you go to this you see this is the button from message i click it i refresh it and i try to execute it you see it is not running because i have not given to the button so i have to pass this to the button here that on click of the button we have to fire on masses like this and for that we need props dot this and save it now it is completed and you see that if i press this then i have the same that we have from here refresh it so when i click from the app it is also running the same event when i click from the message then it is also running you see both are executing a same message but difference is that here it's a on event handler so we are passing here we are not specifying any kind of data type but when we are passing as a property then this property is a method or a function and this is a property name that we have to mention here if you don't want to use interfaces in place of interface you can also use type so how you can use type just write here and you give the name masses props equal to like this and copy paste this like that and we can make it comment save this so all are equivalent remember that this all are equivalent here and i just go there click here refresh it and click here you see everything is going fine so in place of interface you can use type also or in place of type you can use interface also all are equivalent now question rise that if we pass some parameter or event in this function then what is the changes for example suppose here i want to pass the parameter that what like event event handler here by default parameter that i want to pass and this event i want to pass here also now what are the changes you see we have this and we again we have a error that this event is not specify what kind of event you want this and remember that this event is a mouse event and we are passing same event to this method this function so it generating a error for resolving this error we have to specify here that it is the event of react 
dot mouse event then in mouse event we can also specify that is html button html button element like this we can specify that we are clicking mouse event as a button that's why we have this and we are passing this here remember that this is here now in this function here i want to read this event this we are passing from here so just go there and pass here event that we want to read again here we have to specify that what kind of event is there so it is mouse event and we specify that is html button element like this and save this now we can use it here also so we say event like this and i save it so this parameter we are passing from here remember that we are passing from here to here we are specifying a data type and we are reading the property here in this function so what are the changes i refresh it and if i click from the app then we have the button also on click the property of function object which we are passing as an event same we have when we are clicking on a message you see then if we if we pass a value from here for example with this event if i pass some other value like i say i passing a id number and i save it so again it will generate error because the parameter is not specified here in the declaration so what we have to do i have to specify this also here and i say this is the id of number type remember that save this so i specify here it is of number type and that id i can also specify here that it is id which we are passing of number type and that information we can also read here and i save this i remove this for more clear display event this is the id which i am passing so we have a on click message here also you see that this is the, this is the changes here because this id we have to pass here if we are calling this so that's why i do some changes for passing id and event here also so i use uh, arrow function notation here i say event and here i also pass event and id as a value and i save this you see it is running now because i am also calling this here so now i pass id number uh, i say id number 10 from the app and i pass id number uh, here 20 in place of 1 i pass id number 20 from the message and i save this and you will see that bot display different id i just refresh it so if i click from the app the id number is 10 if i click from the message the id number is 20 you see that we have the different different output as per the variable or parameter we are passing to the function so this is the way in react with the type script for passing event and handling with the data type of the events similar way if you have other mouse event you can mention here if you have a keyboard event you can mention here if you have a other type of event similarly just specify here and you can do your work in react with the type script so these are the changes and this is the way to work with event and passing a event as a property in react with type scripts that's all in this video if you learn something please do subscribe thank you for watching this video